Pure Sindala. Pure Sindala. PT one and zero zero zero. PT one and zero zero zero. Canon Jarus. Canon Jarus. Call Cat Arm. Darth Treya. Darth Treya. Jason Solo. Jason Solo. A Sag Ventress. A Sag Ventress. Jaina Solo. Jaina Solo. Asta Lashan Darth Malak Darth Malak Galen Merck Galen Merck was so powerful in the Force, he managed to disarm Darth Vader as a child during an Imperial attack on the Wookiee home planet of Kashyyyk. Vader was impressed with young Galen, and decided to take the boy back with him and train him as his secret apprentice who would one day help him overthrow the Emperor. In the Force Unleashed, Galen eventually switched sides and joined the Rebellion. He even defeated Vader in a duel on the Death Star, and almost managed to kill the Emperor. Grand Admiral Thrawn Grand Admiral Thrawn has the distinct honor of being the first major villain introduced after the death of the Emperor in Return of the Jedi. Thrawn is a brilliant strategist and virtually unstoppable on the battlefield. While he first appeared in the novel Heir to the Empire and was later wiped from continuity, Thrawn is so awesome that Disney decided to bring him back to the official canon as a villain in the Rebels animated series. Mara Jade Skywalker You ask any fan of the old Star Wars EU who their favorite non-movie character is and you are more than likely to hear the name Mara Jade Skywalker. This Force user began her life in the service of the Emperor, who used her as an enforcer and assassin. After her master died, Mara Jade decided to leave her assassin life behind and become a smuggler. That is, until she met Luke Skywalker in the Timothy Zahn novel Heir to the Empire. Eventually, Mara Jade becomes Luke's wife. Ahsoka Tano Ahsoka Tano Darth Nihilus Darth Nihilus Revan Revan Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and like and comment down below and also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then take care Bye!